This is James from Gamefront with our walkthrough of Hunted, the Demon's Fort. This is part 14 of chapter 1, and it's the last part of chapter 1. I'm so glad to be done with attention, chapter 1. So beyond this doorway, spoiler alert, there's a boss. A big, bad boss. Trap. I don't know why it says circle, because when I press circle, uh, the first time I played through it, it said skip the cutscene. And I obviously didn't want to skip the cutscene. What is that? See, oh, I did it again. This guy teleports. And. Uh, so really, the best choice is to kill all these other bastards that are shooting at you, because it ain't worth trying to shoot at somebody teleporting away while there's plenty of good so uh, uh, solitary, um, static. Uh, there's plenty of, plenty of enemies not moving, they're just standing still. So kill those guys first. Is he? I'm gonna take a shot at him though. Oh, shnikes. Come on, Kadok. Thank you. I'm using my, uh, my special arrows. They're explosive, and they are awesome. Gotta get a little further away in order to use these arrows. Bunch of foot soldiers? No, I'm not referencing the TF. I don't know. War cars. I, I don't know. Wargars. There's a side of me that feels like there's no reason to create all these different names. So these guys are either goblins or orcs. So I'm, not, I'm not an expert on the fantasy genre of what kind of monsters are monsters, but I know this guy's unique. Alright, now it's it's unavoidable. I have to attack this uh, teleporting monster. Is he? Caddick, don't fail me now. Thank you. Just the thing. Spell's not working too bad. I think I'll. And he's done! It wasn't even as hard as that big skeleton. Or are those Wargar crankier than usual? Crankier and stronger. Must be from being cooped up underground for so long. Perhaps the Death Stone will shed some light on this. Storm the human village. Bring them to me. Alive. For each prisoner. You will be rewarded with this.
creation was that? I thought... Did we just see his past? The Death Stone grants its bearer insight into the lives of the dead. The more powerful the spirit, the more powerful the insight. You'll grow accustomed to it in time. The Wargar were drinking something. Could it have been that silver liquid your father spoke of? Perhaps. Oh, there is potent magic within that liquid. Perhaps it is something you can use to your own advantage. Your father described it as evil, and I trust him more than you. My father knows little of the ways of magic, and he deems anything that he does not understand as evil. All I am saying is that if you find yourself overpowered, that liquid just may save your life. Regardless of whether or not you choose to claim this liquid's power, give me the crystals you have gathered, and you may still partake of mine. This must be the well the Lord Mayor spoke of. Aye. The entrance to the dungeons. I don't see any traps or pressure plates, but we better be sure there's oh, no... Oh, come on, old man. You want to live forever? <laughs> With you around, girl, I'd settle for making it to tomorrow. Next, we'll be going to part 18 of the entire walkthrough, but part 1 of chapter 2. This is James from Gamefront reminding you that you can find all the best walkthroughs, hints, tips, cheats, easter eggs, what you want, we got it, at Gamefront.com. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.